So uh, today we'll be checking out our new plugin. That's the WooCommerce binary multi-level marketing plugin. Now the uh, web store admin can make use of this particular plugin to integrate a binary MLM system into his web store. Apart from that, uh, the customers can sign up to be sponsors. WooCommerce MLM also allows the administrator to manage many layers of sponsors and the sub sponsors from the backend panel. The admin can have two distinct customers as sponsors within this particular plugin. When uh, the customer's desire is there to become a sponsor, uh, it is being accepted by the admin. And the customers who have become sponsors will receive the sponsor IDs as well. They can then use their sponsor ID to become a sponsor for the other two customers under them. And this chain will not be broken. The commissions uh, are earned by the sponsors by adding the two sub sponsors. And as the network expands, they continue to earn the commissions there so uh, today I'll be showing you the workflow of this particular plugin at the storefront and we'll also be checking out the back-end uh, uh, configuration settings for this particular uh, plugin but in today's video tutorial I'll be showing you how a user would be able to register as a sponsor and the different sponsor account panel options uh, that are there for the uh, sponsors there so in this video we'll be uh, showing you these two uh, things but before that, uh, before proceeding further, please do subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to receive the latest updates from our end. And uh, apart from that, if you find this particular video kind of helpful, then kindly do give it a thumbs up. So now first we'll see how to register as a sponsor there within the uh, web store itself. So uh, the customers need to tap here on the sponsor uh, 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 link that they can see tapping on that. Uh, brings up these uh, registration for the sponsors where the sponsor uh, the customer who wants to become a sponsor uh, can register himself by entering his email address password and uh, the sponsor referral ID that he has received from a sub uh, uh, sponsor there that is under the admin so uh, every uh, sponsor can add two sub uh, sponsors under them because uh, this is a binary MLM system so uh, let's get ahead and let's uh, register uh, ourselves so I'll just go ahead and I'll be entering the details here so I'll use the email address as Pete this and I'll set the password and I'll enter the sponsor referral ID thereafter now I'll check the I accept the website's terms and conditions for becoming a sponsor there and we can check the terms and conditions and privacy policy as well by tapping on these two links and the respective uh, CMS pages would open for the terms and conditions and the privacy policy. So to register as a sponsor there I've entered my email address password and the sponsor referral ID received from the sponsor there and then I'll have to tap here on the register button. Now after tapping on the register button, we'll be uh, registered as a, a sponsor, but uh, what we have to do is we have to purchase a one-time membership to become a sponsor. So we'll have to add the MLM membership first into the cart and we have to make a checkout thereafter. So right now you can see that after creating the account on the left hand side, we only have the customer dashboard options and not the uh, MLM uh, account options. So uh, to do so, I'll have to purchase the one-time membership to become a sponsor. So I'll add this uh, MLM membership by tapping here on the cart item. And this would add the membership into the cart there. And now let's uh, proceed to the checkout there. Here I'll be choosing my first name, last name and the rest of the details. So we have to make uh, the payment of the $100 there for the MLM membership uh, first. So I'll tap here on the place order after that. Now for the placing of the order, the admin needs to uh, complete this order. Uh, unless uh, the admin has completed the order, he or the sponsor will see the same uh, message there uh, that uh, you have to purchase one-time membership. So let's go to the admin backend panel and let's uh, complete this particular order. Then we'll come back. So uh, so here I'm at the backend. I'll just go to the WooCommerce and orders. And I'll find the particular latest order that we just placed uh, for becoming the uh, sponsor here for the order number 147 and uh, we'll be uh, completing this order so I'll just choose here as completed and I'll update it here now I'll just go back to the uh, sponsor account there that we had uh, created 
and let me refresh this particular page now so as soon as I've refreshed here you can see that uh, now we have the customer dashboard as well as the uh, dashboard and the account options for the MLM uh, system there so here we have the dashboard sponsor ads genealogy tree wallet and the referral link so under the referral link uh, if I go to the referral link uh, you'll find the uh, sponsor ID here now if I want to add uh, more sponsors under my own account there then I'll have uh, or I can just add two sponsors under me so uh, to add the same uh, I need to give them the sponsor ID that is here so I can copy the sponsor ID and I can provide those two uh, users uh, the particular uh, sponsor ID so that they can register themselves as a sponsor under my section there now let's go through the different options that we have here within the uh, account uh, panel of the uh, sponsor so this is a new sponsor so I'll be just logging out of his account and we'll be logging into uh, the already created sponsor there so let me log out and uh, let me tap here on the sponsor uh, option and here I'll be entering the username and the password and we'll be logging into our uh, sponsor account thereafter so let me tap here on the login button now so here we are on the sponsor account now here on the left hand side I have the dashboard sponsor ads genealogy tree wallet and the referral link so under the dashboard here we can see the complete gross earnings the wallet balance the pending amount that needs to be still given by the admin the downline members under my own tree my sponsor level and my sponsor badge as well so depending upon uh, the sales that you have uh, done there uh, according to that the uh, sponsor badges are assigned to the sponsors as well so this was about uh, the section about the dashboard that shows the uh, left for example here you can see that we have a complete uh, details here uh, the member activities the badge histories uh, the sponsor ID the email joining date uh, the sponsor referral here along with the uh, name and the email of the sponsor there we have the bonus commission uh, graph uh, level up commission graph joining commission sales commission uh, commission comparison so uh, I'll be showing you the configuration in the second video of this particular video wherein I'll be showing you the different commissions and how they can be applied uh, for the sponsors there now coming to the sponsor ads uh, here uh, the uh, sponsor will find the complete list of uh, products of the uh, store admin and from here he can uh, basically uh, choose to copy the links and can share the links to the customers so that the customers can purchase these products apart from that he can tap here on the share option to share the particular uh, link or the Facebook Twitter LinkedIn or can send it by email as well uh, there so you can use the social networks as well to share the uh, sponsor ads there so that these are being uh, purchased by the different customers there so that was about the uh, sponsor ad here also you can see that you have an option to open the link so if I tap here on the open link for the Woo singles for example product I'll be taking to the product page of the Woo singles product there now coming to the genealogy tree here we can see the different uh, 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 what we say as the levels there here I'm as John Doe is the sponsor uh, under the admin and under me I have uh, more uh, sub uh, what we say as the sponsors there so here you can see the same let me minimize it a bit so that we can find or we can check these let me close this out let me expand this uh, okay so here you can see uh, the different trees are there uh, under the John Doe we have the Kate Doe and the Kathy uh, there so under one sponsor there can be only two sub sponsors under Katie Doe we have uh, two more sponsors under Erin I have Ellen one more sponsor there and that's how the genealogy uh, tree can be uh, watched over by this particular sponsor there so now let's go to the wallet section and here the sponsors will find here their wallet balance there so whatever payouts there are made for the uh, sponsors uh, or the commission that is uh, given out that comes into this particular wallet balance itself and uh, apart from that uh, the uh, sponsors can also add uh, the amount to their wallets by entering the amount uh, that they want to wish to up, uh, update and add to wallet button needs to be tapped after that 
and this uh, adds the MLM wallet uh, with the price and the quantity into the card then uh, the sponsor just needs to make a checkout as a regular product there and that particular amount gets added to their wallet there apart from that all of the wallet transactions are visible uh, to the sponsors here along with the reference the amount the type with a credit or debit along with the date and the time as well so that was about the wallet and lastly we have the referral link and we've already gone through this here uh, after we have registered as a sponsor under uh, one of the sponsors there using the sponsor ID now because I'm a sub sponsor I also have the sponsor ID and I can make use of this sponsor or the referral ID uh, to add two more sub uh, sponsors under my own account panel so I'll have to just copy this up and provide this uh, sponsor ID or the referral ID to the two persons that I want to add under my own account or under my own uh, genealogy tree there and after they have been added then the main uh, 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 what we say as the sponsor can find the complete details of the added ones under the uh, genealogy tree there itself so here he'll be finding the complete details of the uh, sponsors and the sub sponsors that have been added like Erin has only one sub sponsor Katie Doe has uh, Sam and Erin Kathy here has uh, two uh, one is uh, this one and the other one is Harry and so on so uh, that was much about uh, the uh, plugin itself uh, that's uh, the WooCommerce uh, binary MLM uh, system there and I hope this helped you out in uh, understanding the workflow at the uh, sponsor end and how to register as a sponsor and the sponsor account panel options if you still have any questions queries suggestions or requirements then kindly do reach back to us at support at the date of webcool.com raise a ticket at webcool.tubidus.com apart from that if you find this particular video helpful then do kindly give it a thumbs up and lastly thanks for watching this particular video and have a great day ahead